I'm only 23 years old and I've back tested a strategy for over 25 years that I literally went back in time before I was born and this still works. Even today in 2025, I trade this every single day. And all it is, is it's an inversion for a rally gap off of another for a rally gap. So the first thing I look for is I want to see some sort of obvious for a rally gap form. So in this scenario here, we have this gap and this gap. So I just, I'm going to combine the two. The second step is I literally just look for an inversion for a rally gap. So a bearish for a rally gap right here that just gets smoked. People just absolutely love his strategy. And he's got quite a good reputation as an IFBG trader. So naturally I wanted to code IFBGs and see if it's something that truly has a high win rate. Let me break down the model that I'm coding right now. First, you wanna see direction. Here we're making higher highs and higher lows. Now we can assume a bullish bias. Here's a high volume news release. Next I see we're clearing London highs. Let's mark out the New York pre-market range. Now here's our high time frame FVG. We wanna use the FIB tool. We need to see price retrace to the 50% level. We're just going to leave it like this for clarity. Now we need to move into the lower time frames. All right, let's zoom in. First of all, look how beautiful this accumulation and manipulation distribution is. Anyways, we need to see an SMT with ES here. This manipulation needs to smoke the New York range into the high time frame fair value gap. Here's the inverse fair value gap for entry. Usually we do want to see it smoke it, but a break and close is enough. Stops below the low, and this just absolutely clears the high of the day. Now, as you can see, I've already coded in the low time frame entry model, coding in all this high time time frame shit is what's difficult. Give me like two weeks. Stay tuned.